AKA Bye. Okay. <laughs> Mi gente, we are here because we cop. We cop the one like 96. Woo! We cop them. We we cop the sauce. I call them the sauce, the hot sauce. No waiting in line. No waiting in line. Okay. How, how long were we in line for? Three seconds. Three Bye. Seconds. Anyway, peep it. We also got UNC's over here. Earlier release. Uh, November 9th, I think it was. Black Friday, so y'all see, we got all the levels. We got, we got all the levels that roll. came out this year. Whatever y'all need, we got. Got it. Now we're gonna get into the shoes, you know? I always wanted to do this, especially with my boy over here. He's a, he's a master when it comes to this. So, let's get started. Uh, impressions of the shoes. Too much red, but for its own good. I love it. I think it's just enough red that it's like sexy, beautiful. Just the icy bottom, I ain't feeling it. Kills it for me. I don't know about you. For me, my favorite color is red, so this is a no contest. This is just, for me, it's just the best. I mean, icy bottom sucks. It would've been nice, black bottom, like what they had with the Stingrays. I don't agree with that. AK Harris. I don't agree with that, though. That's my opinion. I think they should've had the bottoms like these right here. White. Yeah, that, white is bottom. Would have been sexy bottom. Nah. It, white gets dirtier faster. Than it gets bottom. dirtier, but it's just sexy. It goes with the shoe overall. The icy bottom, I don't know. I mean, we're never going to see eye to eye. Me and him never see eye to eye on icy bottoms ever because he just don't like them. I like them. I just don't like when they start to yellow. It pisses me off. But that's just natural. It happens. But I mean, it is what it is. I mean, it's a nice shoe overall. I mean, another thing they could have done is changed the Jordan sign and turned it white, which he disagrees with me again. Just because it goes with the shoe more. You know what I'm trying to say? The Jordan sign was white instead of black. I think black was like just out of there. It's like, uh, like, I don't know, tag contrast maybe, but in my eye, I don't know. Now, for me, if you add the white, you're getting the uh, Carmelo PE. If y'all don't know what that is, y'all can look at it. Carmelo PE, that's what it got the base of the shoe off of. All red with the white jump, man. So I guess they didn't want to copy his shoe, so they added a black. My opinion, I like the black. I feel like the black pops out more. You know, the black stitch in the 23. Not stitch, but it should be stitch. If you By the me. way, that's something me and him always agree on. Like, we I hate. feel like you're paying 220 why not get quality? Like It's not stitched on. The hair is, we get stitch. But this ain't as you see, the on. one like 86. And these, None of them are stitched on. They're not stitched. You put these on, they crack. And we get mad at that because we want to put our shoes on, but we also want to be OD fresh, and we can't keep them OD fresh because it starts to crack as soon as you slide into it. It just cracks. This is how it is. And to tell you the truth, for 220, we should be getting you know crazy. What you paid like, for? The quality that we used to, that, we, that we got before, you know, with the Concords, with the leather they they used before. You seen the new Space Jams? I might show you a B-roll shot of those, but. The Space Jams, the leather were horrible. The the, the release from last year, they were horrible. They, the, the leather was not, it was it, there was no quality in the shoe. So we don't, you know, when we, when it comes to the leather, the leather the leather is what makes the shoe sexy. So put an emphasis into it, put an emphasis into the stitching, you know, make it, make it worthwhile for people that get it, you know what I'm trying to say? I mean, it's a beautiful shoe. I love red, he loves red, it's our favorite color. Red couch, you know we ain't playing right now. Red is the red. Red is the, red is no joke. Our our color, but they could have tried a little bit harder for two twenty for two hundred and twenty dollars. Could have tried a little harder. You know what I'm trying to say? We both agree on that though. You yeah. Could have tried a little hard. I mean these sexy's held too. Sexy's held too. The, the the blue carbon fiber. The, the shoe goes together with the blue contrast. Everything's beautiful. But you pay two twenty for these. A sexy shoe. I have no complaints with this shoe. I think this shoe is fucking sex. It's beautiful. But 
it's not stitched. So when we try to rock these shoes, it's gonna be cracking. Now I hate those. I, I and he loves them. I hate them. I don't like them. My girl loves them. She's behind the camera right now. His girl right there loves them. I I I I, I love I have love for the shoe, but at the same time I don't. He he yeah, I mean he could explain to you more about it than I can. But I don't know man, it's just not my it's not my type of J, you know what I'm trying to, it's not my type of eleven flow, you know. It's too it's too bedazzled for me, you know what I'm trying to say? The gold is sexy though, I ain't gonna lie. We with the Harris. We with the Harris guys. I like the shoe a lot. Black and gold white. Who can I like those three colorways in a eleven? Colorway sexy. In eleven. You know what I'm saying? Black missile, black soul. Come on. Beautiful. The only thing I don't like, the carbon fiber, we can't get an actual carbon fiber and extend the grade school sizes. Talk about this. The stingray. I don't like For it. For him. He says it's too flashy, it's, it's too, too girly, much. like the glittery and all that. For me, I like it because I like shit that pops. Sorry, excuse my language, guys. But I like things that pop. This pops. When I look at this, you everybody compares them to the OVO 10, 12, you know what I'm saying? It is an OVO colorway, though, if you think about it. Yeah, it's an OVO colorway, you can say that. It look like, it can, you, it's it inspired. Has, is it, I heard in forums it's, it's inspired by OVO. So, I mean, by, you know, Drake's line of shoes. Uh, but, I mean, he he loves, he loves the, I think this is like bedazzled J's, you know what I'm trying to say? My girl loves them, my girl rocks these. She got them, like, three days later she rocked them. You know, it, it looks sexy. It looks sexy on the feet. It's just not my type of style, you know what I'm trying to say? I, I stick to my old school roots, you know what I'm trying to say? My 72 10s, love these. You know, all other joints. I got these, we got these, I mean, he got more shoes, like I'm telling you, his shoe collection is ridiculous, we're going to get into it later on, his shoe collection is worth more than probably my car right now, it's ridiculous, he has a lot of shoes, but, I mean, right now, we're showing you guys the 11s that came out this year, what we think about them, I mean, out of all these three start, shoes, start with the first release, out of the first release, sexiness, out of three shoes, I give this number two. Just number two because it's a sexy shoe overall. It just makes sense. It makes sense. The only complaint me and him have, well, I have. I don't know about him. I have more complaints. Is this ain't stitched on? And I'm a, I said it like 20 times in the video. I'm gonna keep on saying it. it ain't stitched on for 220. You should at least get some stitch on this 23, yo. At least, you know. I don't know where his thoughts. We're gonna get into his thoughts right now. Get these from one to ten. Huh? One to ten. One to ten. I give those an eight and a half. I give those an eight and a half. Sexy shoe, man. For these. I like them in general, you know. They're a nice colorway. I feel they remind me of the, the Columbia that came out, aka Legend Blue, but you see the carbon fiber. You know, I like the shoe. This is you put on a Yankee hat, psh, navy blue, white, pretty much goes with anything. Yep. Um, for me, I would give this shoe from one to a ten. I probably give it an eight. An eight, only because. These are not really my colors like that. I'm more of a red, black, white, gray. That's how we do it. So, that'd be my opinion with the one like 82s. Still a clean shoe. Still a clean shoe. It's a beautiful shoe. It's a beautiful shoe. It definitely is. It's a beautiful shoe. But we, we move on to those. You can start now with Now we go to the Black Friday. The Harris 11s. What you give them, bro? What would you rate them? Top three? Out of all these three, I give them a three. Scale from 1 to a 10? Yes. Just because it's got the gold, you know what I'm saying? Because it got the gold. I give him a 7.5 because it got the gold. If not, it would have been a 7. If it had no gold, it would have been a 7. Just because it got the gold and it's a sexy shoe with the black. And I love black and red are my two favorite colors. I love it. I love it. It's, it's just beautiful shoe. It's just this bedazzlement right here is just killing me. I give it a 7.5. Will I wear them? No. Will I buy them and keep them there just to look at them once in a blue moon? Even though that sounds stupid, I might. But I wouldn't wear these. I can't rock these. I don't know. I can't. I, they wouldn't fit my flow. They can't. I don't know. I can't. But I gave them a seven and a half. For me, I'll probably rate these from one to a ten. I'm going to be honest with you guys. The quality, I'm not that big with the quality on these shoes. They, they, they didn't really... Uh, the quality, I don't think that, the, you know, I'm not too fine with the quality on this shoe. But overall look, this is 
very good looking sneaker. In my overall opinion, I'll give these. I really like the shoe, so I, I have to give it a ton. I really like the shoe. I like the color. I like everything about the shoe. Just the quality, I'm not that big on it. Because it's a gray school, aka. So, I'll give these a 10. Because I like these a lot, you know. We actually ten? got a, a 10. A 10? A 10. Wow. A 10. A 10. So I like the colorway. I like everything about the shoe. Everything I like. Stitch, 23. Come on. You can wear these Woo. numerous times. So you don't have to worry about the bottom getting yellow. It's a plus. It's a plus. It's a plus. It's a plus. 10, man. On looks? 10. On looks. On durability? I mean, on durability, I don't know about durability, but on like usability wise, I give it a 10 because of the black sole. It's true, he says. But looks wise, man, I don't know, man. Out of all three shoes, what, what do you need to clear this one on the list? One, two, or three? It's a tough one. For me, like I told you guys, colorway, obviously that'll be number three in my list. From going three to one. So that'll be number three. Now this is a tough one, but to be honest, I have a weak spot for red, all red shoe, red general. So I would put these probably number one to number two, and then the Winlet 82 to number three. That'd be my order with the three shoes. Y'all know my number one is right here, right here. This is my baby. My girl is right behind that camera. She knows how long I'll be waiting for this. She knows if I had to fucking, if I didn't have the money, I'll come up with the money for these shoes. I, I, you, like, I, I stutter, cause I love these shoes so much. These are my, these are one of my favorite shoes to probably not ever release, but on my top five favorite shoes, these fall in it. These fall into that category. No ifs, ands, or buts. These fall into it. And especially, I'm a big, I'm a big 11. I love 11. This is my favorite J's that came out. 11s, then 12s, and then I like sixes and then fives. But I love, I love 11s. 11s, I think top five shoes, a uh, majority of them are, three of them are 11s, and two of them are 12s. And then the Rex just trickle down to like the fives, the sixes, or whatever. But, I mean, I love the shoe. The shoe's sexy. Like I said, if it was white over here, and they had a stitching, man, it would have been lit. It was, the shoe would have made more sense. It would have matched. In my eye, I like matching. It's on point. It would have matched. It would have made sense. You like the black because of the contrast. I mean, it is what it is. This shoe, I give it a fucking nine and a half. I give it. I will not give it a full ten because of the the black. I will not give. It, I'm honest. I'm honest. I'm honest. It's not. It's not a perfect shoe, but it's good enough. And it's good enough to get a nine and a half. And a nine and a half, coming from my perspective, because you can ask Eric. Eric is behind that camera. I'm a very, very picky person when it comes to anything. When it comes to shoes. When it comes to. Wow. When it comes to shoes, I'm not cutting that out. When people say you medicine. When it comes to shoes, when it comes to clothes, when it comes to I'm, I'm very picky when it comes to it. So I got these on nine and a half, but these are my number ones, yo. These are, uh, out of all the releases, these are my number ones right here, man. For me, of course, out of the three, they're my number one. My girl knows. Red, for me, is a no brainer for anything. Quick story we go to a clientele, right? And he sees the th the photos, right? What was yes, it? Yes, yes. This guy photos. wild out. He was like, "Baby, gotta get this shit right now. <laughs> get this shit right now." He had no plans to buy anything that day, bro. He I made it possible. He went up to carry like, "How much is it right now?" He got the shoes right there. He had, like he has a weak spot. He loves red shoes, yo. When you see his collection, you'll see a majority of his red. He got he got fire. I ain't gonna lie, he got fire. He got the raging bulls. He got he got it all. He got big big boy red shoes. He got them all. All he's missing is like red bottoms. And for his girl too, right? You want red bottoms? Red bottom red heels. Bottoms. Oh, you gonna you better get them heels, boy. She. She gotta get the red bottom breads. Uh oh, bye. Get... Breads, love breads. Breads, love it. But yeah, man, continue, I like bro. I bread too with butter. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> continue, Juan. Huh? What do you? What I do think you we thought? should get a girl's opinions on the shoe. From, boom, boom, boom. I think that's fair. All right, guys, so you know what? We're going to get an opinion off of Erica and Jami. They're going to sit here and they're going to opinionate on this shoe. I mean, we picked this shoe for them to talk about because it's our favorite shoe in terms. And wait, before we go, though, what do you give them? One to a ten? They get a ten. All right, they get a ten. Nine ten, and a half to ten. Ten, and eight. 
Alright, so nine and a half, ten. So you know what? It is what it is. Shoes beautiful. We're gonna get the two last opinions from the girls. These shoes, the runner-ups, the good shoes, but they're not they're not saucy, man. They're not they're not saucy enough. They, they're not hot sauce. These, these are hot sauce. These this is this is like paprika. This is ready to go. You know what I'm trying to say? This is pepper. This is uh this is chili. This is everything, you know? Shoes are just sex. It's beautiful. So beautiful shoes. So uh that's basically it. I mean, we're gonna have the girl sit down right now. Uh, then we'll go from there. We'll come back and we'll end it up. And uh, sooner or later, if you guys like this video, we we'll, we will send the completion. You know, uh, and give if you guys up to your boys, give it a thumbs up. And we might just have a shoe reveal with this kid, man. His shit is ridiculous, bro. If y'all, if I get about a buck fifty two hundred likes and reviews on this. I'll take you out, and we will go through my entire sneak collection. And trust me, he, he got the sauce, man. He got. I don't got the it's sauce. Worth. I'm still trying to catch up with the sauce, but so give them likes, them viewers, and trust me, we're gonna go. I'm gonna give you a tour of Flyboy JC all day, Classic. every day. Whose phone is that? Yo, I'm vlogging, bro. Yo, I'm vlogging, bro. What are you doing? <gasps> All right, hey guys, I'm Erica. You guys already know by now. And I'm the panty dropper, lovely legs. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Drop me legs to the motherfucking Ortiz, okay? Let's get it popping. That's a lot of editing for you. <laughs> right, you want to put me on the camera, right? What do you guys think about the shoe? It's red. Duh. And it's nice. I honestly, I'm, I'm going to give you my honest opinion, okay? Woo! Red, all red shoes, I'm a fan of. Okay, I'm a fan of all red shoes. But I'm gonna be honest with you. Yeah, you can rock out red with everything, but when it comes to black shoes like these, they take the win. I'm a big fan of all black shoes, and I love the bedazzledness. The you, bedazzledness of what? the shoe is like yeah. it's nice. The one thing though is that red, it's a sexy color. Red is sexy. Red is, I don't know, red is sexy. Like you red is a red sexy color. And it's... you're like, oh damn, you look sexy. Black is an elegant color. Like you can you can dress it up, you can dress yeah, it up. Yeah, but you now. can't really be that elegant with Jordans. Yes, you can. I mean. You can wear them with like a nice, you know, with nice suit, well not suit pants, but you know what I'm saying, like a nice blazer, something like, you know. Fun fact, fun you fact can... though, fun fact. They did wear Concords with suits. They, I they didn't know. Did. I don't know who it was. I don't know if you, you know. You can. They, they, they did wear Concords with suits. So you, you can wear them off. Like you can but wear anyways, them off. Back to what I was saying. Okay. I'm a big fan of red shoes, but when it comes down to it all, I am not 100% with my boyfriend. So I don't agree with him 100% because of the simple fact of it being that I like all black shoes. Because I feel as though all black shoes are all black and white shoes. To me, honestly, I would rather rock them out. And, you know, that's just my opinion. See, my opinion when it comes to shoes, all of my shoes are gray. I will get cool grays before I get either one of these sneakers for myself. Just because that's me. That's what I like. Like, I mean, I have those shoes, and I love them. They're black, they go with everything. But I feel like I can match gray with every single color that I want, because it's a shade, it's not technically a color, but I'm not even gonna get into that. All right, so guys, I'm gonna put my shoes from a one to a three, and I'm gonna have to go with... How you feel about those? What, these? Those I like these better than the red ones. No, I disagree. I, I like, like the red ones better than those. I like the just blue. because I like blue. Blue is my favorite color, guys. Just so you know, blue is my favorite color. All shades of blue. That's my oh, thing. Man. I love blue. That's my favorite color. But blue on a shoe. Let me tell you, I have military blue fours, and those shoes I can't like. I can rock them with a lot of stuff, a lot of outfits. But when it comes down to it all, black and white shoes, you can rock out with anything. You can rock out red with anything. Yeah, you can. But I mean, you can't rock out red with certain pink. colors, you know, pink, like, yeah, like pink, orange, all those different types of colors, you can't, you know? Um, 
But these shoes, let me see them. These shoes right here, I mean, do you want me to rate them? Yeah. Okay, I'm going to rate these shoes. These shoes, I would say, I'm going to rate them at a... Like a good seven. Like a seven. I'm, no, seven. I'm going to rate them at an 8.5. I don't know. Just because when it like has good, the light blue, you know what I'm saying? With good lighting and a filter, they're like an eight. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. I, I'm a big fan of the... Navy blue, I love. I love the like the navy blue. blue. I mean, honestly, I think I would have liked this shoe a little bit more if the Jumpman was like black. I don't oh, know. I like. I honestly, that's just the way I feel. I there's I no other black on the shoe. Though. I'm not big. I'm not big on the on the baby blue too much. But I'm not big on. It. I do because not that shoe. It matches the icy sole. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not so really. So that's why I like it because it. You see this shoe. All right. It's all red and then bam, random black, bam, random icy sole. I don't like that. This one, the Jumpman matches the icy sole. This matches with this and this matches with this. So it's like well put out. Like it's well thought out of the colorway. It's well thought out. That's why I like this shoe better than the red one. But that's just me. Well, I like the carbon fiber better on these shoes. That I agree with because I, I don't fuck with this. I, I don't Honestly, with this. this this carbon fiber, I'm not a big, I'm not, I'm not a big, I'm not a big fan of it. Okay, just because it looks like a checkerboard. <laughs> yes, I'm I, not really. I was thinking of something to it say. It doesn't too. look like you know. It doesn't like look a, like carbon fiber. It just looks like dots. It just looks like pretty much dots. You you it know, like it's not really a really good design. I'm big on the holographic, you know, type of look. I'm I'm big on that. You can put these back on there. But the holographic type of carbon fiber, guys, I'm big on it. Yeah, it looks so, way better. Let's hop on to the next shoe. So, oh wait, so we have to rate them. Oh yeah, right, rating. So, so what's this, your rate? For these, I'm a, uh, again, I'm gonna go with the, like a 7.5 for these. Okay. I'm gonna I, go that's with. That's just my opinion. I just, I, I, it's a beautiful shoe. It's a beautiful shoe. But I don't know. It's just, I don't know. I like, I like these better. Okay, so I like these way better than the red ones. Okay, so guys, now my opinion. These shoes, I'm gonna rate them at a. I'm gonna put them at a good nine. I'm gonna give them a nine. A solid nine. Just because I, like I told you, black, white, the carbon fiber, big fan of these. And, you know, the red, the, the shininess, I'm big on it. You know, I'm big on it. And I like the way. I like the 11s in general. Any 11, I'm pretty much a fan of. So I wouldn't rate them. Any 11, I wouldn't rate them lower than a five or a six because that's just my opinion. So, pass me the shoe. The shoe, this shoe, I'm gonna have to rate it at. I'm gonna give this shoe a nice eight and a half. Now you know what? I take it back. An eight. I'm gonna yeah. give it an eight. It's an that's just filter. that's just the way I feel. Um, I feel as though the pros and the cons are pretty much are even on this shoe. I'm not really like, oh my god, I have to buy these shoes once they're released. I'm not that crazy about it. So this one. I mean, if it had the stitching, eight. it probably would have. It's not even about the stitching, honestly. It would have been I'm like just, a good eight and a half. Yeah. Okay. Just let them know you don't fuck with that crack. Yeah, beer. Jordan, I mean, come on, bro. We're, we're paying man money for this. Like, I know you got money, so you don't care. Like, I know you don't care, but we care, my brother. We care, my brother, and I gotta be stitched, bro. Like, you know, I gotta be stitched. All right, now these, these are my favorite just because I have them. And it's just, it's a beautiful shoe. It's just, it's elegant. The gold, the way it just reflects on the light. The way it pops, the white with the old black outsole, like God, like it's, it's. The all black sole, let me tell you something. This is going to save you guys. I'm going to tell you this right it's now. It's going to save. It's going to save you guys a lot. Way better than the icy sole just because these get yellow way faster than these guys right here. If you sit here and get all blacked out soles, you're going to pretty much be good. As long as you maintain your shoe the right way. Take care of your shoes the way we do. You walk you'll be fine. with your heels instead of your toes. Correct, correct. Because a lot of people wonder why they get creases on their shoes. 
Because you don't walk. You don't know how to walk. You have to learn how to learn walk. Learn how to walk. We'll do people. You know what? If, we will do a demonstration. If you give us the right amount of views and, and likes, likes and all of that, we'll we're going to teach gonna, you, okay? We're going to we'll give teach you, you a one on one lesson. Bro. Okay, because we know we're better than the guys Hell when it comes yeah. to this type of stuff. And we got small and cute feet, okay? We don't got these. We got small Look feet. at this, okay? Look at this. You know? This shoe is bigger than Jumper Lex. Yes. Okay. <laughs> like, Guys, I'm a midget, just to let you know I'm five one. Like, so yeah. I don't um, know. I just I love the way in general elevens always look better on the on the feet. I'm gonna be honest with you guys though. Okay? There, here's one thing though. I love these shoes. Yes, I do. All around. But when it comes to I'm a big thing when it comes to laces as well, because that takes a toll on the shoe. Okay? On um, these on um, these, the laces, if I mean, I'm not, you, you'll see what I'm talking about. The laces, it's just like, I feel as though after a certain amount of time, once you have, once you wear the shoes a couple times, you know, the laces, um, they, gonna they stain wear. the shoe too as well. They start to stain the shoe. They're going to start to tear. Yeah, so you, you don't want to overwear these shoes. That's one thing. Yeah. So I'm going to write this shoe right here. Like I said. This the is laces, a, this, I'm not, is, this is a nine for me. I'm not even. I'm not even gonna go to a ten because it's a nine because, like she said, the laces. Um, eventually they start turning kind of white or grayish. Yeah. Like the more you wear them, just because of the material of the lace. Well, first of all, these are the type of shoes you don't want to tie the laces. If you, you can't are a tie real the Jordan laces. fan, you don't really tie the laces. You let them hang. That's why you got. Thing. That's why you got the gold tips and Correct. you just let it hang. Correct. You don't want to be tying these laces too tight because, first of all, it's gonna stain your tongue. Okay, it's gonna stain your tongue and it's gonna stain your sides, especially here because it's suede. So See you now. don't want to sit here and you know damage the shoe, especially the, you know for the price you pay. <coughs> so I'm gonna give these shoes just because I love the gold. Also, I'm a big fan of the gold and the sparkliness. Um, I'm gonna give these shoes a nine and a half, not a full ten. Like I said, that point five is because of these laces. So yeah. One, the one that. thing though that I would like, I just want to add real quick, like if the tips of the laces were like, instead of gold, but like red, like plastic red laces, like the tips, instead of like the original tips, I would like that a little bit better, just because, okay, this is a long ass shoelace, but just because like if you want to wear it out like this, like how most people wear it like that, like when you have it like flopping like that, it will look a little better. That's just my opinion. I don't know. It's details. Details matter. So, I don't know. So, my first shoe, what I'm going to go with yeah. is these babies right here. Those are my first. These are my first. For both of you? Yeah. Correct. And then my, my second. UNC is a second for me. I'm going to have to go with the all red. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to have to go with these guys. UNC is a second for me. And then, of course, number three is. Number three for me is Jim 11. Those guys over there, the blue ones. So she's nobody, going, not everybody she's at tie. That's that's nope. good to know. Yeah. Everybody, the we whole all, point is everybody got their own opinion. We all have our own opinion to the shoe, and I mean it's a beautiful shoe. I just I just like the way the UNC, you know, the colorway. I think just, me and me and Juan the, differentiate between the UNCs and the blacks. You guys don't see eye to eye with the red and the UNC. I mean it is what it is. Yeah. Not everybody's gonna like the same thing, but yeah, we all love shoes, right? That. We see eye to eye to that. We have to disagree with that and that. Yeah. So it's the opposite. It's a little opposite. It's a little fun experiment we did today. Oh, we here. Look at the little puppy. Look at the little puppy. Oh, look at the little puppy. All right, guys. Anyways, we got 11s for days. You know what I'm Hello? saying? Hello? Yes, yes, yes. Mr. Yes, Jordan? Yes, yes. Stitch the 23, please. Please, stitch the 23. Uh, nobody's going to laugh? I don't no, get that it. Way, it wasn't that funny. Who did a better shoe? It's a video. The I mean, the females didn't get that much spotlight like we did. But Guys, just pretty much important. comment. Boy, hashtag boy, hashtag girl. Who Let did us the know. win? Let us know. This is not a competition. The point of the but, video was for us to all share our, perspect our perspectives. Uh, women, men, you know, and we saw the perspective today. Uh, we didn't agree upon a lot of things, but that's what makes us us. So. We're going to continue to do this with more shoe releases that come out. Uh, maybe we'll do just the guys sometimes, just the girls, you know, boys versus girls. You know, we'll come up with a whole bunch of stuff, but I mean, sexiness in everybody's hand, man. We enjoy shoes. We love shoes. 
Shoes are beautiful. Uh, my people might think that we're stupid for liking shoes. I think you're stupid for not opening up your eyes to these shoes. Um, Sexiness. Let us, guys, please like, comment, share this video. Tell your mama, tell your sister, tell, tell your, your side grandma, chick. Tell your side bitch, tell your main bitch, tell your great great grandmother. From everybody. This is from everybody. Dios te bendiga y que la pase buena tarde. tarde.